Hey Simmers, it's Amy, and welcome back to episode 9 of The Sims 4 Let's Play The Bachelor. Um, we last left off, Nick had gotten off of a group date with Nancy and Sunny and Bambi, and we are going to have him go on a one-on-one -on -one date with Corey. So um, Nick is sleeping right now, we're going to let him sleep. Corey is also sleeping right now, so... Um, Ooh, let's see. Sunny just had a... She is tired. She, she needs to go off to bed. So I don't know why she's not taking care of herself. But um, let's find a bed for Sunny to go into. And Savannah is also tired. She's going to be going to bed. And Nancy needs to use the bathroom. Where is Nancy? Um, she is using the bathroom and then she's probably going to be heading off into bed soon as well. So let's make sure she do, does that, even though really for this particular episode, it's mostly going to be Nick and Corey that I'm going to be worried about. So, uh, Nick, as soon as you get up here, you are going to use the bathroom and then let's see if we can figure out this food situation. If we have... Any food? Oh, gosh, that's nasty. Um, already in the fridge? No, of course not. Why would we do that? Um, let's go ahead and you definitely need to be getting up here. So let's see if we can have you make the butler uh, make us some food. It probably would be easier if after he actually makes the food, I like have one of them put it in the fridge. Um, so we have something here, um, some fish and chips. Um, but that's just, I mean, it's not spoiled quality. It's just sitting there. Perhaps Nick could just eat that, I guess. But, um, Corey is sleeping. She's going to be getting up soon. I suppose that this date is, might be taking place kind of like early in the morning. Um, if their needs are already in, we don't really have anything else to do. I'm definitely going to go ahead and send them on their date. I think in the last episode I had mentioned um, the possibility of going, um, like, volunteering. And I did look at that. Oh, I, I guess I can show you really quick. Um, it this is, These are the options that come up with the... Um, new parenthood pack but they don't you don't you can't actually control any of them when they're there so volunteer to bake sale a uh, beach cleanup nursing home a soup kitchen and a walk to fight a disease which is all pretty cool options but you can't actually control them so I'm not gonna have them do that um, we have Bambi taking the initiative to just sleep in Nick's room um, which I really don't like when <laughs> the Sims do that but um, I guess whatever. Nick is on his phone and let's see, hopefully uh, we have some food getting cooked here. Let's maybe have him just clean this up because it just looks tacky. And Corey's going to be getting up soon. We'll perhaps have her come join Nick for some breakfast as soon as it's ready. Uh, Nick definitely needs to get something to eat soon. Um, he's rather uncomfortable, so, um, I didn't realize that, like, Sunny and Corey have, like, some of the same hairstyle when they're sleeping. That's kind of funny. Um, Corey, why don't we go ahead and get you up? Well, let's at least wait until the food is ready. Nick is going to go play basketball. Um, no, Nick, we're going to have you call everyone to the meal and definitely make sure Corey gets up. Does anybody else? Bambi is just a hot mess right now. Sunny, yeah, everybody probably needs to get up, except Nancy is probably pretty good. But let's just get everybody up and have them come down and eat some breakfast together. And I think I had, um... I don't know if this is going to work, but I'm going to see if I can move this to, like, let's go in their main, like, big dining room and see if I do that here, if they will, 
like all sit together. Call to meal and sit. Cause that would be kind of nice. I like want them to try to like have some group interactions. So, um, yeah, let's see if that works. Um, Sunny definitely has to go to the bathroom and then, um, we're going to have her come down and get something to eat. Yep. It looks like it's all queuing up. So hopefully everybody is going to be coming down to eat relatively soon. So that'll be nice. And then, like I said, I know sim time, it's like super early in the morning, but we can go ahead and send Nick and Corey on their date. I'm not entirely sure at this point where I'm going to send them to. Usually I already have a idea in mind of where I want to send them. Um, I don't for this particular one. So, um, I guess we'll just have to kind of be surprised. Maybe. I don't know. I mean, I guess we'll find out soon. Um, Nick wants to flirt with BMB. Um, not probably suitable for this particular moment. Um, so let's not do that for right now. But, um, yeah, this I think is going to be, hopefully be a fun date. Um, Let's see, Corey, you're definitely doing good. Nick, you are doing good. So I'm going to have them finish up their meal. I'm going to speed up time just a little bit. And so they can all finish and then send them on their date. So is that Corey? Um, no, she's doing pretty good. And so is Nick. So yeah, we're going to cut out here and we will meet you at the date. All right, Simmers, I decided to make them go to the Neon Restaurant and Club, which I had created as a collab with my friend Lucrecia. And so I know we've already kind of been to both of these lots before, but um, they were made by me so and my friend. So obviously I feel like I am able to come back here. Um, and I will add the links in the description box below so you can download them and add them to your game. Um, so I think they want to play darts. I think that'd be kind of something fun. So play darts with... Corey and um, I don't know I haven't really used uh, they haven't really like done anything like they've mostly just been having like conversations and stuff so I kind of want them to do something Corey where are you going she's going upstairs to talk with somebody um the bartender up here. Let's have her go back downstairs and play darts. And um, let's see. Nick wants to. Oh, she can't do that because Nick's already playing. All right. Well, let's forget about the darts then. Nick wants to compliment someone. Well, let's compliment Corey. That sounds like a good idea. Um, compliment her outfit. Um, I don't remember if this is one of the dresses that she was wearing before. Some of the girls, I just kind of changed, um, like the color of the dress that they were wearing. So made it a little bit better. Um, and then some of the girls got a whole new like outfit. So, um, yeah, that's, uh, I don't remember if she was wearing this or not, but that went quite well. Um, he now wants to hug someone. Let's see if Corey has a Nick whim. She does. She wants to get to know him. So friendly and let's see, get to know. And she wants to hug someone. So let's see if we can hug Nick. Friendly and uh, hug. There we go. And Nick, how are you doing now? You also want to hug someone. So that works out great. You guys both want to hug someone. And let's see if you guys can dance together. Um, dance battle. Cool. Let's do that. 
I have never done that before. I don't think anyway. So let's um, check that out. Let's not watch the romance channel. Let's just dance with Corey. And who do we have here? Um, another fellow nightclub person at almost 5 o'clock in the morning. We're going to go to the dance club. Nice. Um, so this is kind of cute, Nick. Um, you're showing off your moves and Corey seems to be kind of digging that. So that's kind of nice. Um, he wants to hug someone. I thought they just hugged. Did, um, only Corey get credit for it? Maybe, um, I guess maybe only Corey got credit for it. She wants to, looks like karaoke. She wants to tell a joke. So let's have her after your little dance battle. Let's have you be funny with Nick and tell him an inside joke. And we actually have this lot functioning right now as the restaurant. Um, so there's like the hostess and everything over here. Um, but I, I just kind of wanted them to be where maybe perhaps a lot of other simmers are sims aren't so um yeah okay now she's telling a joke so that's good she also wants to chat with somebody this is definitely um you know ask him about his day um their friendship level is definitely the highest easily out of anybody else but i don't know if maybe like their romance is like not there like you can be really close friends with somebody but not have a romantic interest in them um but then again i say that and now nick wants to woohoo with Corey. so let's just see if we can flirt um i think that's flirting is just kind of taking place of the woohoo because we will definitely get some woohoo action i think um later but we are not going to be woohooing woo with anyone when there's still five girls left i don't think that that is appropriate so romance um he wants to make out so let's see if we can kiss Corey um at least nobody pushed him away because that happened in our last date um and that did not go well and Corey wants to tell a dirty joke so let's do that and she also wants to watch a karaoke performance. So let's have Nick. Um, ooh, he wants to use a bold pickup line and still make out with Corey. Um, let's have him, let's have them sing a duet together, country. That would be kind of cool. Um, Cause I don't want them to pull ahead. Like I don't, I like Corey as like, you know, in the Sims, but I don't want her to pull ahead too much, um, and make it hard for like some of the other Sims to kind of catch up. So, um, I don't want them to just keep doing all these like romantic interactions, especially when they have a one-on-one -on -one date. Um, it just doesn't seem fair. Let's do a check as to Nick's relationships. So yeah, I mean, it definitely Sunny is, or Sunny, um, Corey is definitely the highest friendship level. Um, it looks like Bambi is probably currently in last place. Um, the romance level, I'd say, is probably a tie between Corey and Nancy, um, as being up there the highest. Oh, we got a text message from Lizelle. Uh, she wants to go to a concert with him. Maybe she's just not quite getting the hint. So I would say by looking at this, because um, we're going to be going into a rose ceremony in the next episode, um, it almost looks as if Savannah or Bambi would be um, getting the boot this next episode. Personally, though, I mean, I really kind of want to get rid of one of these blondes. Unless Nick has a thing for blondes, it looks like he does because uh, Nancy, Sunny, and Corey are all probably, like, the highest. Um, so...
So I don't know, but of course I always post a something on Facebook and I let them decide what um what I should do. So it is for the most part kind of out of my hands. I try not to um like control too much of it. I try to let it be what the Sims want and what like Facebook wants um when they vote. So we will see. Oh, she is embarrassed now because of her karaoke performance. Well, that's okay, though. I mean, at least it's not a social interaction with uh, Nick. That would be definitely worse off, in my opinion. So, um, it looks like Corey is using the bathroom. And Nick is in a flirty mood. He wants to be friendly with Corey and also make out with her. So... Corey, as soon as you're done, she's also now in a flirty mood. Where is she? Oh, but she's still embarrassed. I mean, we have to give her maybe a little bit of time to, um, does she use the bathroom all the way upstairs? Where are you, Corey? Oh, she's behind the mirror. That's why I couldn't see her. Um, give yourself a pep talk. We're just going to make you do that so you can hopefully not be so embarrassed. Um. So, yeah, and then let's see, we want to not do any of these things. You want to make out with Nick. And let's see, Nick is just kind of watching some TV while Corey is now apparently on her phone. But no, let's not do that. We want to... Um, Nick wanted to do something specific, be friendly. So, um, let's have you guys come over here and sit together and chat. That'll be nice. And then Nick wants to be friendly with her. So, friendly, ask about her day. And... Let's see, Nick. What are we else are we going to do? You're energized. Um, It's like 9 o'clock in the morning, actually. We probably could send them back um, home, and perhaps he can have a little bit of time with some of the other girls. So let's go ahead and do that, and I'll see you guys back in just a second. So we are back here at the house, and let's see if any of the girls have any Nick whims here. Um, so we can maybe, um, well, Corey does, but we just had a one-on-one -on -one date. So, oh, Nancy does. She wants to woohoo with Nick. So again, I'm just going to take woohoo as like flirt, <laughs> um, for this point in time. And let's see if he can, or she can just flirt with Nick. Um, and that's nice because Nick is actually in a flirty mood. Um, he wants to level up in charisma and he wants to volunteer. Um, Nancy, hopefully you are going to find Nick. Oh, looks like you guys are possibly going to be meeting here in the little foyer, I guess. So where, why, why? Oh, um, Nick wants to be friendly with Savannah. So after he talks with Nancy for a minute, he can go um, talk to Savannah and let's see, Nancy, are you, are you guys just passing each other? Why? Why? I don't understand why it does this. Now Nick is going downstairs and Nancy is in the front. <laughs> like, I don't understand why The Sims does that sometimes. Um... Now Nick is going all the way back upstairs, passing uh, Sunny, or sorry, Savannah in the staircase. Um, and it looks like they have just exited out of that, like, queue um, on their own. So, Nick, let's see if we can send you back downstairs and hang out or talk to Savannah. I want to be friendly with her. Um, discuss interest with her. Sorry, Nancy. I don't really know why that happened, but it did. So, oh, and one more thing I wanted to check here, just like, just to see, um, woohoo with, like, who comes up. Still just Corey is the only one that he is able to woohoo with. Um, although other girls have wanted to woohoo with him, 
Um, it looks like Corey is the only one he is able to do that with. So, um, he's being friendly. He also wants to schedule a date. Well, we're not going to be doing that. He wants to sauna woohoo. Um, interesting. That would be quite nice to do at some point. Oh, Nancy, you've decided to come back down here. And, um, but you don't have your Nick whim anymore. But at least you're just kind of hanging out and, like, talking. So, oh, this would be fun. I do want to go on a date um, to, like, one of the festivals. I keep saying I want to do that, but we are not going to be doing another date today. We're just going to spend a little bit more time at the house. And then um, we're going to head into the rose ceremony for the next episode. So... Um, yeah, I'm just going to kind of see if we can get, okay, Nancy, no, Nick, we're going to get rid of this Corey thing because, you know, you just had the date with her. Ooh, it comes up. He wants to woohoo with Savannah, but again, like when I come up to the bed, it doesn't give me the option to do it with anybody else but Corey. I wonder if it'll give me the option to do it in the... In the sauna? Woohoo with, no, still just Corey. But it comes up as a whim that he wants to woohoo with Savannah. Um, but he definitely doesn't have the, um, like, the romance level to do any of that. So I will, again, just kind of mark it in my notebook when I do the reviews and stuff. Um, I kind of, like, watch back the last episode and kind of see what... Um, what I think should go. Um, Savannah wants to be funny with Nick. So you can tell him a funny story. And Nancy, let's see if we can get you another Nick whim to come up. Yay! You want to flirt. Flirt with Nick. So more choices. Romance and flirt. Looks like your place doesn't need any ser my services today. Um, and you want to volunteer. We're not going to be doing that. Nancy also wants to cloud gaze with Sunny. Not going to happen. Play darts. Not going to happen. Um, Nick, we're not going to be able to woohoo with anybody just quite yet. But what is this? Do something romantic. Um, that's going to be kind of hard to do while there's two girls here. Um, I mean, I don't mind if they, like, want to flirt with him. Um, Nancy, did you not flirt with him? Or did it just not give you credit? Or did you want to flirt with him again? Let's see. Flirt. Oh, maybe it just came up. Win a game of darts and woohoo with Nick. So, um, meet somebody new and get to know Sunny. And Savannah, let's go back to you. Let's see. What's this? Eat an excellent meal. Um... Yeah, nothing really coming up with that. Nick, how about you? Anything with Nancy or Savannah? Because they are the ones that are right here right now. Or if one of them, woohoo with Savannah, if one of them leaves, you can flirt with um, one of them perhaps. Oh, and it looks like Bambi has come down. She is bored. Um play a computer game, complain about her love life. Let's check on Sunny really quick. What is she doing? She's upstairs watching TV in her underwear. And I think all the rest of everybody is downstairs now. Yeah. Oh, it looks like Nick and Savannah now are going to be going upstairs. So let's see if we can take that as they want to have some alone time perhaps. Um, let's actually send them in the hot tub, get in and, uh, get in Savannah. Let's send you guys both over here. Since it's right here, it's not going to take you too long to do that. And, um, cause Nick had some make out with Savannah, like whim and also do something romantic and flirt. So let's have you flirt with her um romance flirt and oh 
she like went underneath. Um, we could see Corey on the computer. That's kind of funny uh, in the background. So, and you also want to make out with her. Um, I don't think that that's gonna like come up from. I think we have to do some more um, flirtation things um, before that's gonna work. But it looks like she is getting out of the hot tub. She probably needs to work on her needs. And Nick um, definitely needs to kind of work on some of his needs as well. Um, I think this is going to be a good time to go ahead and end the episode now. And for the next episode, we are going to have the rose ceremony and the elimination. So make sure you let me know in the comments who you think should be eliminated. Before I do that, um, let's really quickly just kind of look at some of their relationships one more time. So you can kind of vote based off of um, what you've seen as far as interactions and then the relationships and um, I will see you guys all back for the next episode. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.